I've tested more than 70 surf skates to date, and most of them had a pivot cup squeak right out of the box. And I've made a few videos in the past teaching you how to get rid of those pivot cup squeaks by using either wax shavings or grease. And while that works, there's a way to get rid of your pivot cup squeaking without ever having to do that again. And that is to simply replace your stock pivot cups with Riptide pivot cups in their WFB formula. And you can get these from Riptide directly, or if you want to support my channel, you can get them at surfskate.love forward slash shop. And at the time of making this video, we have Riptide pivot cups for Carver CX, Carver C7, and Yap. And we're working on getting them for all the top 10 surf skate trucks, and I'll let you know as we have those available. Riptide explains on their website that their WFB formula has a unique lubrication that doesn't bond with the urethane, and that's why when you look at these up close, you'll see a white residue on them, almost like a chalky substance. And that white residue is that lubricant, and that lubricant acts as any other lubricant so that you don't have to keep putting wax shavings or grease into your pivot cups. So let me walk you through how to replace your pivot cups, and I'm going to teach you a little bit of a trick that I've learned to do this. So I'm going to replace the pivot cup off of a Carver CX, and the first thing we're going to do is remove our kingpin nut, and we'll remove the hanger and the bushings and set those all aside. And now we see our pivot cup right here. So there's two ways we can get this pivot cup out. The first way is we can use a flat screwdriver to dig it out like this. And you can get pretty aggressive with these and, and really dig it out. And some of these work, but I found that Carver pivot cups in particular are very tight. And so that method doesn't really work for me. So it might work on some, doesn't really work for me on carvers. So here's a trick I've learned if you've got a really tight pivot cup that you can't get out is I will use a Phillips screwdriver here with a Phillips screw and all I do is just screw into this like so. I kind of hold that screw steady and I'm pushing really hard to push through that pivot cup while I turn. And what this is gonna do is screw through that pivot cup and then eventually it's gonna hit the bottom there and it's gonna push that pivot cup out, just like that. So you see that pivot cup coming out. Once you have it out a little bit, then you can just take some pliers and pull it out like that. And then you're gonna just take your Riptide pivot cup like so, put it, slide it in there like that, and that's it. And we'll put these washers back in place. Make sure that you have your, on your CX, if you're using a CX, make sure you have your taller bushing on the board side followed by your hanger, and then followed by your shorter bushing on roadside, and then we put our kingpin nut back on. 